new day, a new emergency. This time with a dog and a snake. Dogs are natural hunters and they go after snakes, which often leads to disaster. We need to get there fast. Sounds like we've got a terrible situation with a spitting cobra and more dogs. Apparently the snake cruised in there and the dog saw it and attacked it and threw it up in the air. So the woman just managed to get the dogs away. I just don't know about the snake. Hi. So the dog's all right, is it you think? I don't know, I'll go check on her now. She seemed all right. Okay. She's just been spat at. Uh, Sounds like the dog is okay, but okay. I have a horrible feeling that this snake is already dead. As we get there, I can see the snake just laying there and I thought, oh, it looks dead to me. But as I get closer to the snake, I get my hook and all of a sudden, it stands up. It's still alive. Okay. Oh, is that a middle? Oh, it's quite a few puncture wounds. As I get closer, I can see it's badly injured. Some bite wounds here. It looks like bite wounds, doesn't it? Hang on, I just want to see if it can move. Because it's a chance it may have severed its spine and then the snake has finished. Can you move? No, it's moving. Very, very active with the spitting. It's moving fine. It's just got puncture wounds, but we need to know. You're right. Oh, it's got a big puncture wound underneath. Okay. Let's get that in a box. We'd get that treated. Are you going to be able to fix it? I don't we'll know. have to have a oh, look at that. I would say that snake's had it. Although it can move, it's got a massive bite mark there, another one there, and another one there. The snake had three puncture wounds one in the lung and stomach area. One on the side, which doesn't look so bad, and another one towards the end. So it's been bitten three times, but amazingly, the spine seems to be okay. 